Hi, this is Anil from Learning Lad Education, and welcome back to what's the output video series on C programming language. So, uh, just like the previous tutorials, you can scan uh, pause this movie and take a look at the source code which is here in the editor, and try to get the output of the program. Once you get an answer, just click on the play button. I'm gonna run the program and explain the output. All right, now I guess you guys have an answer for this program. I'm gonna build and run this. So it's gonna be build and run. And the answer for this program is going to be 27. So you guys may be guessing some other answers. And now let's see how the heck we're going to get the output or, you know, the answer of this program as 27. So here in this program, we have used a macro called eggs and we have the macro definition as five plus two. And then we have an integer variable i and then we have i equal to x multiplication x multiplication x and then we are printing the value of i so here what happens is the preprocessor is gonna process our source code before the compilation process and it's gonna search for the macros and replace them with the macro definition so here uh, in this program what happens is our preprocessor is gonna search for this x and replace that with 5 plus 2. So before the compilation process, this preprocessing will be done and an intermediate file will be generated and that intermediate file will be passed to the compilation process. And in that intermediate file, we're gonna have i equal to and then this x will be replaced by 5 plus 2 by the preprocessor. So it's gonna be like i equal to 5 plus 2 multiplication 5 plus 2 multiplication 5 plus 2 it's gonna be something like this and then when we run the program at that time what happens is the multiplication operator has the higher precedence over the addition operator and that's why the multiplication operator will be executed first you know after that multiplication step we're gonna get something like this so it's gonna be 5 plus 10 plus 10 plus 2 total is going to be 27 and uh, you know this printf function is just going to print out that value 27 so that's why you know we're going to get the output as 27 so this is it guys thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel check out my website learninglad.com and like my facebook page facebook.com learninglad and i'll see you in the next tutorial